Hello everyone, this is Ahmed Don of AhmedDon.com. Today I'll have another episode of Gmail Tips and Tricks video and I'll talk about how to create and use Gmail templates. If this is your first time or repeat visit, thank you for your support. On this channel, I'm always trying you on different ideas. If you're into thinking outside the box, this is the channel to subscribe. If you're looking for more tips and tricks videos, there'll be links in the description box below. So templates are very useful when you're replying back repetitive email or you can even filter some emails to send auto reply using templates and that's what I'll show you today. So the first thing it, you need to do before even starting using the Gmail template, you have to enable this uh, in your settings if you haven't done so already. Go to the upper right corner and you, you're going to see the whole button so click on it and here click on see all settings you're going to look for advanced tab which is going to be right here and then here templates and then you see that this is disabled so you have to just click here and this is going to enable the template and then you have to save the changes by clicking right here so now we are going to create a fresh template and the first thing you need to do you have to create an email so click on compose and if you look on the lower right corner there are three dots so just click on it and here's an option template and if you put your cursor on here then you can see that there's no save template so in order to save your first template you have to you know create a template and save that draft as a template so let's just write a template so subject would be test template and we write here hello thank you for your email okay so this is our draft email and we're going to click again on the lower right corner where the three dots are so click on it and then go to templates and then here you see that it's giving an option to save draft as template and if we choose save as new template click on it and then here it's asking to give you uh, give the template a name so we can just call it test template so save so now we have created our first template so what I can do, I can just, you know, get rid of this and let's fresh, uh, compose a fresh email. In order to insert the template, you have to click on the lower right corner. So click on it and template and here, any template you create is going to show up here and you can choose the only template right now, which is the test template. So if you click on it, then you can see that it's inserting you know the blank email you created or that email you saved before as your first template so that's what you have now as your first template so now you can just you know modify or update this email and send it to someone as a fresh email now if you'd like to delete a template then the process is the same you have to you know click on the dots and the template and delete template and then it's just going to show you all your templates and then you can just delete whichever you'd like so I'm just going to you know get rid of the draft now I'd like to show you how to send or create auto reply using template so the first thing you're going to be doing you have to search for a term so let's say that I'm just going to pick a term here Facebook uh, because we have an email here Facebook so let's just say Facebook and click on here search options so now here you can see that there's an option to create filter so if you you know from you have to choose where the email is coming from and then where is going to or coming to and it has the words Facebook so let's say that you know uh, you can choose uh, any email coming from Facebook or someone you'd like to block and it's coming to that uh, your email address you have to just complete these blanks and you can even modify these you know parameters and then once you have done that then you have to just like you know create on create filter 
So now if you when you click on that then you're going to see an option that send template. So if you click on it and then choose template so you can just choose the template you want. So what happens here let's say you know you're getting uh, an email from someone then you can just create a template specifically for the person that you know you're not available or you can just like you know uh, create a template for anyone who sends you emails or anything well, it could be from Facebook or from Twitter or from anyone and you can use template to you know send them auto reply using the template or using the template you created just to give them a like you know uh, set answer for whenever they're sending you email and then once you're done you can just hit here create filter and then that's going to create a filter and anytime uh, any uh, email comes from that address and you know uh, fill the criteria you mentioned uh, it, will, it will just you know, reply back with your chosen template so that's how you create template and use template to send auto reply thank you for watching this video there will be more videos coming up so I'll see you shortly thank you